idea basically is to do paintings, sculpture, but everything keeps on fluctuating depending on the demands of my clients. I began by doing portraiture, uh, pencil portraits, because those were the first ones that I was introduced to, and ones I was exposed to at that time. Then I also started doing uh, painted portraits. That was at a later stage when I understood uh, the colouring and all that. Anything that I find that will suitably fit the image is what I collect. For example, when I was seated at, um, when we were still at campus, I was at the Bamboo area and uh, I was completing, but I had no project at hand. So it was until when they brought us meals and they brought spoons alongside the meals. That's when I noticed that now, you see, it looks like an ant. But at first I showed it to the, uh, the friends that I was with and they were not seeing what I was seeing. So to, to, prove, to prove to them that I'd seen an ant in these spoons was when I first created one, which was a bit rugged and uh, so it became my prototype, uh, which I used to come up with a formula to do all the other ants. I normally make sure that the thing is perfect and it, uh, and somebody can easily appreciate it from afar because the law of attraction is what really guides us on selling these products. So when, when somebody likes what you've done, and you've done it perfectly very well, they do the marketing for you. 